Hi, this is JP from Not the Lights of Arkham. This time in Chaos Magic, we are playing the to um, Iron Man Protection deck against Crossbones on standard difficulty with the uh, uh, suggested modular sets in the campaign guide. So, uh, Hydra Assault and uh, uh, Legions of Hydra modular sets along with the standard one. We also have the experimental weapons here. And there is the Weapon Master um, modular set in the deck also. Uh, last time uh, I tried to build a random generated deck, but the website was uh, under maintenance, so I wasn't able to use that, so I had to build a deck. And here you can see it on the screen. I won't go into detail on the deck, it's really fastly generated, and I just wanted to use some of the newer. Uh, protection cards in it and that is basically it uh, there are like bait and switch and uh, ever vigilant and some of the newer allies and all also dauntless but the usual energy barriers and stuff like that so nothing going into detail on the deck so check out the deck building episode if you're interested and that is basically it. Um, let's see if I can manage to uh, win a game in this series of Chaos Magic, so let's get started. So I have pre-shuffled the decks. Uh, last thing we need to do is when revealed, we um, reveal the first card here. So response gets the energy shield. Uh, attached to the villain, attached to the villain gains retaliate 1, hero action spent, uh, energy and mental resources, discard this card, so I'll just place it here. Uh, we'll draw our opening hand of 6 cards. So we get uh, stock tower, rocket boots, power of protection, genius, ever vigilant, and uh, uh, Avengers mansion. So, we still can't... Uh, I think we are not flipping on the first round, so... I think I'm keeping the Stark Tower. And also the Rocket Boots, and... Uh, could actually... Actually play the Avengers Mansion, yeah. So... That. so I'll keep the whole hand. We are building for the first turn, so unfortunately Crossbones probably will advance, but it is what it is. So we are playing the Avengers Mansion. I'm using the Ever Vigilant uh, Genius and... Uh, do I want to use the Power of Protection or the Stock Tower? I'll do it like this, so I'll use that. We'll get a card, uh, Repulsor Blast, so I'll use those two to... Actually, I won't. I will use the Futurist, so we'll reveal three cards. And we get uh, Mark 5 Armor and Rocket Boots, so I'm picking the Rocket Boots, discarding these two. And I will play Stock Tower. I'll grab Rocket Boots back. I'll play Rocket Boots. And that is our whole first turn. So we got some cards uh, down already. And then we ready up. Roll back up to six. Uh, we get Starhawk, Repulsor Blast, Power Gauntlets, Clea, Bait and Switch, and Arc Reactor. So we are getting we are getting a decent amount of the uh, tech upgrades. So we can uh, go to Hero Mode next turn. We'll go to the Villain Phase. Uh, we add one threat to the main scheme. Correspond schemes for one plus. So we advance. 
Infinity the Stone and uh, reveal that the card of the experimental weapons deck. This comes into play with one. So Crossbones gets their laser rifle. Just place it over here. And that is that. So we get an encounter card. And we get Crossbones armor. So that is that. So that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. I'm thinking of actually doing this so we can put this in better view. So, and uh, we'll start our phase by using the Stark Tower. So, we search for a tech upgrade. We'll grab the boots again. Use the boots and bait and switch to play Arc Reactor. And we'll use Repulsor Blast and Starhawk to play Power Gauntlets. And actually, let's draw a card. Yeah, nothing useful. So, we'll flip. I will. Uh, We'll do something. So I'll thwart for one here, uh, ready with the reactor. Then I will use this to deal one here. I'll hit again for one. So I will take two retaliates. That is it. Let's ready up. And uh, we have a hand size of one, two, three, and four. I think we still need to search for cars, so I'm doing that. So we'll draw back up to four. Ever vigilant, uh, bait and switch, and electrostatic armor. And it's a tech upgrade, so that's really useful. We go to the villain phase, we add a threat here. Crossbone attacks, I won't defend. So crossbone has uh, an attack of 3 plus 2, so we take 5. And then counter card, crossbones assault. Okay, so we get the token here. And this comes into play with 2 threat, so that's not a problem. We can that next turn but of course we need to have a buffer for the activation so that is the villain phase let's go to the next hero phase so this turn hmm, let's draw a card ever vigilant okay so how should we do this so we are playing Claire Using the bait and switch and ever vigilant for that. Then we are using the another ever vigilant for the electrostatic armor. Get another tech upgrade and I will swap uh, here. Uh, Crossbones activates, Claire will defend. So punch and one, so Claire is defeated and we shuffle Claire back into the deck. That is removed. Uh, we ready with the reactor, and uh, we'll put two here, and we'll flip. I'll use the futurist, and uh, I'll use the Stark Industries to grab the boots again, and we'll play Pepper Pots down. That is our turn, we're ready up. Draw back up to six. We get uh, just tightening up here. We get Dauntless, Energy Barrier, Repulsor Blast, Iron Heart, Power Gauntlets, and Bait and Switch. We go to the villain phase, we add a threat to the main scheme. Crossbone schemes for two plus. 
give the villain a tough status card. If you cannot, something happens. Well, let's just add tough here. <clears throat> so, uh, we are at three encounter card is uh, Hydro Flame Soldier. Okay, so that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. So, um, first off, I'm using the mansion. Get Iron Fist. We'll get the rocket boots back. Unfortunately, no double resources for use with pepper pots, but we'll use pepper and uh, rocket boots to play power gauntlets down. Then we will play Iron Heart. I'm using the bait and the switch and dauntless. We'll draw a card. Get clear. We'll use uh, Iron Fist and Repulsor Blast to play the energy barrier. And keeping clear for next turn. So we are healing for three. Oh, yeah, the uh, boots actually gave us some hit points. Just got to add. So I'm up to six. We're a flip. Then uh, I decided to not use Futurist anymore. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six hand size at the moment, which is decent enough. Uh, sorry, se seven because we have the energy barrier. So we're maxed out. And uh, Iron Heart will hit for. One year and uh, actually, could I? Oh, I can't get aerial this turn to get these to fire more. Okay, so we are readying. I'm hitting one here and using both of these to finish this off, and uh, we'll keep clear. We're ready up. Uh, we draw back up to seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. We get Queen Carrier, um, five helmet, armor vest, energy barrier, energy cosmo, and we had clear. So we are stabilizing pretty well now. And we'll add one threat to the main scheme. Crossbone attacks, Iron Heart will defend. Iron Heart should have one damage on. So, 3 plus 2 is 5. Iron Heart is defeated. We get an encounter card. Another Flame Soldier. That is totally fine. So, that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Uh, we start by drawing a card. Another energy barrier. Uh, we'll play energy barrier. We'll use pepper pots to play another energy barrier. Then we'll use. Uh, I think we can use queen carrier to play this, and we'll play Claire. So I think we <laughs> we are pretty much set up here. So I'm uh, doing a double. Uh, let's see. I'll do a double thwart here. I'll use both of these to deal two here. I'll use Clea to deal one more here. That is our turn. Uh, actually, let's back up. I'll leave this uh, one. So I'll use the helmet to remove one. Then I will finish this guy off with uh, Iron Man. Uh, we ready up. Draw back up to seven, so we get an extra encounter card. And 
Yeah, it's ready to also. So we draw five more cards. We have strength, power of protection, repulsive blast, rocket boots, hell carrier, bait and speed times two. So we add a threat here, uh, cross bombs, attacks, uh, I will I'll defend with Clea. So cross bombs hits for 3, plus 1 is 4, I'll use one token from each of these. And we'll remove tough and deal 2 damage here. And still Clea is defeated. We'll shuffle Clea back into the deck. And we get the encounter cards. Uh, Hydra Soldier and Assault. So I'm just defending. So 3 plus 2 is 5. And again we'll use 1 from each of these and deal damage here and five uh, oh yeah we get one from here we deal one here okay Uh, that is the villain phase. I'm just double checking. Yeah, we did everything, so let's go to the next hero phase. Uh, we'll ready up with the arc reactor. I'll thwart it to here. Click my bones. Uh, I'll use the helmet to thwart for one. Now I think we need to get rid of some of these, so I'm getting rid of the energy shield. We need to discard one mental and one energy. Then uh, uh, we need to get rid of that, so I'm discarding one energy and one physical. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we should have uh, placed damage there, so I think we deal, dealt like 3 damage so there, add 3 here, this is about correct, I might be mistaken, I, yeah, I think there's only one left there. So, uh, we'll use the power gauntlets to get rid of this one. We'll use the other power gauntlets to get rid of this guy. Get an encounter card. And then... Uh, uh, let's draw a card with the mansion. So we have double repulsor blast, so I think we're going to blast uh, crossbones. So first one is uh, one, two... Five, one, two, three, four. So four times two is um, eight, nine damage here. I think we used the uh, arc reactor already. And uh, the, we'll just use the second repulsor blast. Actually, we do, won't. I'll use it next turn. So uh, I think that is our turn. 
just ready up. Go back up to seven. Okay, so we have the power of protection, Mach 5, Armor, Iron Fist, Iron Heart, War Machine, Strength and Repulsor Blast. We had a threat to the main scheme, uh, Crossbone Attacks. I won't defend this time. So 1 plus 1 is 2, so I will just take the 2. I'm saving these actually. Oh, actually no, I'll use 1. We can bump crossbones to the next phase. So we get the uh, crossbones machine gun. Or we have to search for it. I'll do that. I think we haven't seen it yet. Yeah, so it's still in, in here. Crossbones machine gun. So we add two ammo counters per player on it. And Crossbone has 14 health left, so we are pretty close of defeating Crossbones in the next couple of turns. We get encounter cards. Uh, first one is. Hydra Jet Trooper with Quick Strike. So I won't defend. I think I forgot to add one damage from the crossbones last attack. So it was one plus one, so we only used one shield. Oh yeah, and actually we won't even use a shield. Well Just thinking of the timing with the electro electrostatic armor, but I think we missed that. So that guy attacks, take two, and I'm using these off, and then this finishes off that, and we get the Hydra Bomber. So choose to either take two damage or place one threat, so I'll just place the one threat here. Okay, so that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. So uh, we need to deal 14 damage, so we have a Repulsor Blast. We could get Aerial to deal 4 with those. Let's first draw one card. Starhawk. Uh, okay. So... Starhawk is 2, Repulsor Blast is 1 plus something. Iron Heart is 1, and could actually play Iron Fist to stun that guy. So, yeah, let's do that. So, I'm using these to play uh, Iron Fist. I'm using Iron Fist to stun, deal 3 damage here, and uh, I'll use Pepper Pots to play Do I want to play Starhawk? Or do I want to play Iron Hearts? Okay, I'll play Starhawk. We are trying to defeat the enemy this turn, so uh, Starhawk hits for two. So we should be at nine. I'll gain Aerial deal four these and hit for one ready hit for another one so we're down to four i think we should be able to defeat on 
this turn. So using the repulsor blast. So one, two, three, four, five. And we get one, two, three, four, five damage. So that is enough to defeat Crossbones. So yeah, finally <laughs> we managed to uh, secure a win in this Chaos Magic series. And uh, got to say it feels pretty good to finally win a game in this series. But of course, uh, Iron Man protection against standard crossbones, so it should be a cakewalk, and it definitely felt like that. Okay, well, uh, that was the game. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. Thanks for watching, and until next time.